Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. Before you replace the brake spring on your riding mower, make sure the ignition switch is in the off position and the key has been removed. Now confirm that the brake is disengaged. We recommend removing the left rear wheel to make accessing the spring easier. To do this, use a floor jack to lift up the rear of the mower. Next, remove the dust cap from the wheel. Use a large flathead screwdriver to help pry the E-clip off. Remove the outer washers and pull off the wheel. Now use needle nose pliers to remove the cotter pins securing the brake spring. Remove the washer and detach the old spring if still intact. Install the new brake spring by hooking the long end onto the brake lever and the opposite end onto the brake rod. Now slide on the washer and secure the assembly with the cotter pin. Now confirm that the spacers and key are in place on the axle. Then slide on the wheel. Replace the outer washers. Secure the E-clip. And replace the dust cap. Lower the rear of the mower and your repair will be completed.